Dolphins are fun and interesting in many ways. They are intelligent, they can communicate with humans and other species. But what's the secret you may ask? It's sonar waves. Uh, it's their way of communicating with each other and it helps them find certain things. The communication, this type of communication is called echolocation. And it travels at a wavelength of 0 0.5 to 25 kilohertz. And how this works is that the dolphins are able to identify an object um, with its wavelengths from sounds or the echoes that they make and how much it bounces back to them. And the crest of a dolphin's wave is, is no more than like one or two feet above sea level since the waves are always traveling underwater. It's always going down or this way. It will rarely pass up sea level since, you know, dolphins live below the ocean. And the through point can be changed depending on where the dolphin is. Like, for example, if the dolphin's a little bit above sea, like sea level right here, and it happens to speak out, of course, more of the sound is going to travel down. But also, some of it may be able to hear up. And the more lower the dolphin is, the more, I mean, yeah, and um, you know, the dolphin's speech, it's, it expands as they speak. It's not just a wave going like that, but instead it is a wave expanding and getting bigger and bigger and bigger. But as like more, more feet or more like space in between passes by, that's when it starts compressing and it starts getting quieter and quieter and quieter to the point where where it's basically going to be muted. And how, like, how does this affect dolphins or anyone in wildlife? And well, dolphins could use this as a form of searching for prey, as well as other friendly animals like allies, and as well as interacting with humans better. Like, the waves of the dolphins can help them seek for food. Like for example, if they know fish aren't nearby, they can use their sound waves to find fish that are nearby. As well as not bumping into like a blind animal. Let's say like a dolphin is right here and it encounters a whale. And let's say the whale can't see where it's going. So the dolphin can just use its sonar waves to communicate to it. And it can tell it like, hey dude, I'm right here and you gotta move. <laughs> And um, as well as it can help them find their friends or family. If a dolphin is lost, they can just use its sonar waves and, you know, do other dolphins can hear it and they can be like, oh, you know, our friend is over here. Let's go with him. Or, oh, my family is over there. I got to go to them. And, you know, it can also help humans by finding certain resources underwater. Like if we're trying to track down a lost ship, we can use the dolphins to just help us, like, use those sonar waves it's the same system that um our u.s like navy uses you know that sonar thing and you know this is important because dolphins are they're an intelligent species so due to water pollution and climate changes a lot of dolphins are like losing their homes and a lot of them are dying and it's up to us to protect and save these adorable and intelligent creatures and of the sea to, so that we can be helping with future research or finding stuff or even just like getting more involved in our sea life with dolphins we can come across this as well as entertaining children i mean who doesn't like going to the zoo and seeing a dolphin do flips or play with the volleyball so in conclusion dolphins sonar energy i mean sonar waves it is very interesting, intelligent, and works in very cool ways.